uh, in 40, so that would be just before the, or around the time of the World War II. Now, your husband wasn't eligible for the draft, I gather. Well, his job was supposed to be important. Okay. To take care of the animals. Yeah. I don't know that he would have gone. Be glad he was he didn't. a real yeah. peacemaker. Yeah. yeah. Do anything, yeah. but not that. How did uh, the war affect the area? Of course, well, you were new in the area, but still. Yeah, I, I, you know, I just had a, my daughter was born uh, right after we moved in. Uh, and, and, you know, I just, between a new business and the babies, yeah. I didn't. Uh -huh. You weren't involved in victory gardens or any things like that? No. Rationing? We had a garden. We had a big garden all the uh -huh. time we were up there. Uh -huh. And rationing, you know, there was a uh -huh. lot of rationing in we were fortunate, though. We got a lot of the food that a lot, a lot of people didn't because of the business and I don't know. Did people pay with food? Pay us? With food? Yes. Yes, uh -huh. they did. Because uh -huh. money is, money is uh, was hard to come by then. That, you know, it's right, right. after we the Depression. A, yeah. I remember we got a lot of jam from one person. Uh -huh. It lasted uh -huh. a while. It was wonderful raspberry jam. Uh -huh. yeah, well, that's, this is your raspberry capital down there in Dundee, yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. Uh, I'd forgotten about that. And he'd come home with a bunch of vegetables because uh -huh. uh -huh. they couldn't pay him. So they paid with produce. Yeah. yeah. He was very lenient about letting them pay uh -huh. or wait without charging yeah. interest. Yeah. 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 Except for that one instance. <laughs> He's going to put them back. <laughs> yeah. You don't remember any stories some people do of the rationing and the gas rationing and the food rationing and the... Obtaining uh, most of no. the Swedish holidays rather than the... Were there any other holidays that you remember oh, we, celebrating? Easter. We always did Lucia. Now what is Lucia? The girl comes in with a, a crown full of candles okay. with coffee and cake. And um, I did that for a long time and then when the girls got old enough they mm -hmm. would do it. And the other girl, one girl would wear the crown, the other girls would wear a, a cone kind of hat. Uh -huh. And they'd come in singing carols. And this is... Uh, wake, the, me, wake us up. Is this around the Christmas holiday or when the is it? December the 13th. December the 13th. And that's a Swedish holiday? Yes. Okay. I so don't you, even know if the other Scandinavian countries have it. I don't know. No. I never thought to ask. I think there was a Lucia at buns. It seems to me that one of my recipes is uh, is it Lucia buns, a special bread that you had for that holiday. What was a coffee cake? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I've made it. <laughs> Book. Okay, in fact, so that's I, I went 13th. to Christina, my youngest daughter in Rochester, uh -huh. on the December the twelfth. When, of course, I knew what was coming. Uh -huh. but I always like it. Uh -huh. What about Easter? Did you celebrate Easter? Pardon? Did you celebrate Easter? <clears throat> Not especially. Not really. Just go to church. Yeah. yeah. Any other holidays that were... Celebrated? No. I, I became pretty Americanized. Uh, Lucia was the only day that we've done Carried that. over. Uh -huh. Fifty-five years you were living this kind of life. Now you've... Uh, your husband died in 1990? And uh, and you you were and when did uh, Reverend Boyd's wife died? The same year. Well, they had lived fifty five, uh, had been married fifty five years, uh -huh. and it was just a couple of years before we copied them. <laughs> uh -huh. I mean, uh -huh. But you you spent a lot of time I socializing didn't realize we together. We were so near in age, but we were. Yeah all the same age. Yeah. But you spend a lot of time socializing with them as a couple then. Yeah, when they were here, uh -huh. we did a lot together. Uh -huh. They would come for the evening with their kids for uh -huh. supper and they would stay and next thing I knew, I'd put my kids to bed, these five kids would be all over the house sleeping on the floor but just fell asleep. Uh -huh. Didn't foster. Uh -huh. You know, make any trouble. They had five, and you yeah. had four. So there were nine children in this house. <laughs> uh -huh. so, not in this house. The house you were in. When, they, when yeah. we were. Yeah. 
This was in Penyan. When they were little, uh -huh. in the other house. Uh -huh. That was uh, in Penyan or on the lake? Where were you? No, right in Penyan, right by Indian Pine. Okay. Between yeah, two yeah. cemeteries. Yeah, okay, right where the business was. You had, Your house was by the business? Yeah, yeah. it was. The, the house hospital. was up to the left. Oh, anyway. Yeah, and the hospital Drive was... Drive in there sometime. You'll see. <laughs> and the hospital was right next to it. Then. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, and so you spent a lot of time... What did people do in those days? Play cards or uh, what, what type of social? We played cards a lot mm -hmm. when we were first married. Mm -hmm. We belonged to a group. Now, when you say those first days when we were married. Yeah, and then when you were associating with this other couple. Oh, with the Boyds? No. Yeah. I guess we mostly talked. Talked. Mm -hmm. Ate and talked. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody does, you know. 